the uh, follow-up shots. And it was real fast, like almost like an automatic weapon. Dozens of gunshots, one right after another, fired into an Aurora home. More than 50 bullets scattered in that house near Peoria and Alameda after the weekend shooting. And now the Kelly family is afraid to sleep in their own home. Thank you for joining us for Denver 7 News at 5. I'm Andrew Heal. And I'm Shannon Ogden. Denver 7's Ivan Rodriguez spoke with the Kellys who say life in their home will never be the same. The more than 50 bullet holes on this Aurora family's home serves as a reminder of the shocking incident over the weekend. They hope Aurora police finds the person responsible so this doesn't happen again. Pretty much a retirement community, normally pretty quiet around here. Alfonso Kelly is a firefighter with the Denver Fire Department, but he and his wife have also been foster parents for years. We had dozens of kids that have come through our home and uh, we did a couple of adoptions from those of those foster kids, which makes this incomprehensible act even harder to understand. This isn't a drug house. This isn't a gang house. This is, you know, we're older, retired, retirement age people. Around two in the morning on Saturday, Alfonso's wife was having trouble sleeping and turned on the TV. So I got up and used to, went to the bathroom. And so as I was washing my hands in the bathroom, I hear three loud shots, boom, boom, boom. And then my wife says, oh, somebody sounds like somebody's shooting. And then right after she said that, I hear a succession of rapid fire, pow, 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 thaw, like an automatic weapon. The bullets rip through their bedroom window and about 20 bullets through their garage door, their car, and shattering mirrors. Since the shooting, they've decided to move their bed to the floor. Until they find the person or have an idea of who it is, we don't want the bed right at the window level. Aurora police did not respond in time for this story. The family says officers told them there have been other reports of shootings in the area recently. The family says thankfully no one was injured during the shooting. Aurora police is asking anyone with information to contact them. Ivan Rodriguez, Denver 7.